what's up youtube that's all beats back with another video if this is your first time to the channel is always welcome today what we doing look like fl studio released the update and i see everybody jumping towards it so i said you know what i haven't been in fl in a long time let me jump in my account let me open it up let me download the beta and let me see what it's about all right so i did all that i went in there opened the beta if you don't know where it's at let me show you where it's at once you're here you go to help you don't have to click the help but you go to help and you go to forum and it's right here all right so that's where you go ahead and go get it but you have to be signed in if you're not signed in it'll be grayed out all right so make sure you signed in and make sure you get it all right so let's go let's jump in i was already working on it a little bit right so in my head i use the mpc i used to use fl studio but it's like i've been away from it for so long it's like i forgot a lot of stuff about it so i was like hmm let me see if i can open it up inside the mpc software so what i did was open installed it but you have to remember when you you can't open up the regular fl studio because it won't be there so you have to open up the beta version once you install it all right I opened up the FL Studio um, as a VST inside inside the MPC software. I can't remember what I did because I was playing around with it and I just wanted to show you what I was doing. So I opened this up right here. You hit this and it opened it up. So I was, you know, messing around with it, seeing what is what it's about, all the plugins and stuff. I know you can do the stem separation, but you know I don't do the chopping and sampling and stuff like that i used to but i don't do it as much no more i try to make my stuff from scratch go to sounds and i was playing around with it i don't know why i can't hear it okay there you go so what i did was i dragged some stuff in there let me close this show you what it looked like so this types loops so i was just st i'm still messing around with it so i don't know you know i'm not used to the fl studio workflow as much no more so what i did was i was just downloaded some stuff you click like right here if you want to add it and then what i was doing was i was dragging it inside the mpc software so i dragged these right here so I was just testing to see if it can work inside the um, MPC software and it did actually work so this right here is a beat that I was working on did I all right so I added the audio first and then I chopped it up and moved some stuff around and then added um, a pitch right here I pitched it up I think it was like or down i pitched it down seven i can't remember was, i was just messing around with it and this is the beat that it came out to be so what i did let's go back to home all right so how to do it you'll hit this and then you hit this plus button right here let me shorten this a little bit I like that so what i'll do i hit this plus button right now i guess it's free for right now and then i what i did i drag it and just drop it here once i drop it here it's inside the mpc now so what i do is go to my um audio or i can just chop it up or whatever i need to do right here All right, so I'm still trying to get back into the groove of FL Studio. All right, so it's crazy, man. FL Studio is doing their thing, man. I wonder if MPC software is going to have that kind of situation inside, inside the software. But this right here is dope. I can't see it being free forever. This right here, this part, I don't know. But right now... <laughs> They got some nice sounds too, man. All 
I like this. Let me download this. Let me drag this in. I like that. I like this too. Let's drag it in. But it's it's a lot, man. It's a lot to go through and mess around with. M FL Studio, y'all doing y'all thing. Y'all keep dropping them updates. This is dope, man. This is fire. So right here, I see they have a sound, then they have a library. But this one look like you have you can purchase it. You have to purchase it because they have a cart right here. But this one had like a free demo. So I hit the download on it, and then it had a search like a search magnifying glass right here, and it looked like it just dropped the sounds right here inside the um inside your sound bank area so this one was just the demo area uh let's see let's try the flutes All right, so it's working inside the NPC software, man. I'm going to go ahead and keep on messing around with this. All right, I'll catch y'all in the next one. Might be the next video. I might be making a beat inside the FL Studio. I don't know. So let's go. Let's get it. I'm going to get back to using it, man. I didn't show y'all the stem separation because there's a lot of videos that did the stem separation. I don't have to go through it and show y'all because everybody else is doing it. I'm not really a sample guy to separate stems and stuff like that. So... Just go watch a uh, couple couple other channels, man, that do it, and you can see it, man. It's dope, man. All right? But if you need, like, drums and stuff like that, you can get the drums or, like, a one-shot drum. You can separate your tracks and chop it up and create it, put some little effects on it, make it your own. All right? Let's go. Let's get it. Catch y'all in the next one, man. All right? Let's go. Let's go.